For everything he does, Elon Musk draws inspiration from his favorite movies, Starship from Star Trek, or the new Bond suit straight out of the movies. The man wore the SpaceX spacesuits, which not only looks cool, but also embarrasses NASA's spacesuit design and tech. But wait, there is more. Watch the video to find out. Hey guys, welcome to another exciting video from Futurism. In this video today, we tell you how the SpaceX spacesuits just knocked out the NASA spacesuit right out of the park. A spacesuit is a suit designed to keep a person alive in the harsh conditions of outer space, vacuum, and even extreme temperatures. Spacesuits are frequently worn inside spacecraft as a safety precaution in the event of cabin pressure loss, and they are also required for extravehicular activity or work performed outside the spacecraft. SpaceX's spacesuits add a complex system of equipment and environmental systems to the basic pressure garment to keep the wearer comfortable and reduce the effort required to bend the limbs. A self-contained oxygen supply and environmental control system is frequently used to overcome a soft pressure garment's natural tendency to stiffen against the vacuum, allowing complete freedom of movement independent of the spacecraft. Space may be the final frontier, but it's widely inaccessible and it's downright deadly to any plucky human without a great spacesuit. SpaceX, a space exploration and transportation company, successfully launched its first passengers into space aboard the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket. Many people couldn't help but notice the beautifully designed white and black spacesuit when they boarded the sleek capsule known as the Crew Dragon. The first time a space company owned by a private individual had accomplished such a feat. The astronaut suits, which were notably different from the orange suits which were used, came as no surprise to anyone, as the SpaceX suits, as they're known, have been in design and development for years. The new SpaceX spacesuits design have reawakened public interest in space exploration, which has long been a dream of co-designer and chief financier Elon Musk. But why has the SpaceX spacesuits piqued people's interest? What is the purpose of spacesuits for astronauts? Consider the various types of spacesuits and their functions to gain a better understanding of this. Astronauts wear one of three types of spacesuits, depending on the mission they are embarking on. The first is the IVA, or intravehicular activity, which is only worn when the astronauts are inside the capsule. Only the launch and entry phases of a space mission require the use of IVA spacesuits. The extravehicular activity spacesuit IVA, which is worn outside the capsule, and the intra-extravehicular activity spacesuit IVA, which can be worn both inside and outside the capsules, are the next two options. The big question now is why are spacesuits so important? The most obvious reason for the importance of spacesuits is without a doubt safety. There are dangerous gases, radiation and temperatures in outer space. Spacesuits are created to replicate the ideal conditions required for the human species to thrive. Without spacesuits, astronauts would die from a lack of oxygen seconds after exiting the space shuttle or the Earth's atmosphere. And the fluids in their bodies, including their blood, would boil or freeze due to insufficient air pressure. Boiling bodily fluids could cause the skin and other vital organs to expand, resulting in death. Spacesuits are also strong enough to protect astronauts from being hurt or killed in space by micrometeoroids and other flying debris. Outside of the Earth's atmosphere, there are also extreme temperatures. These temperatures, which can range from minus 156 degrees Celsius to around 121 degrees Celsius, are lethal. The spacesuits are designed to keep astronauts safe in these extreme temperatures while on their missions in space. The modern SpaceX spacesuits differ from the older NASA spacesuits. Although the spacesuits keep astronauts safe and alive, they were far from luxurious, at least until last year, when SpaceX unveiled its new light, sleek and eye-catching spacesuits. These next-generation spacesuits are the result of an unlikely collaboration between billionaire Elon Musk and Hollywood costume designer Joe Fernandez and NASA. These suits are not only visibly appealing, but they also differ significantly from their previous NASA counterpart, the Advanced Crew Escape Suit. When astronauts traveled to and from the space shuttle, they wore these popular orange-colored spacesuits. They were first used in NASA's mission STS-64 in 1994 and were supposed to be phased out by the turn of the century, but they were recommissioned and modified to their current state, which is known as the Modified Advanced Crew Escape Suit, MACES. Now let's look at the aesthetics and the design of these spacesuits, as well as how they differ from their older orange pumpkin sister in terms of functionality. 
For starters, their sleek design makes them lighter and more comfortable than any bulky looking old NASA spacesuit aces. Compared to the older aces, they are 40 pounds lighter and easier to get in and out of, according to research. The helmets are also lighter, glossier and silkier than their predecessors, dubbed bubble helmets, thanks to 3D printing technology. The SpaceX helmets have valve microphones for communications and a retractable visor that can be locked into place, owing to their striking resemblance to a bubble. Second, they're simpler and safer to use in the development of new spacesuits. One of the key considerations was ease of use, which was lacking in previous ACEs. Modern spacesuits are designed to work automatically with little intervention from astronauts. When astronauts enter the capsule, all they have to do is plug their suits into an entry called the umbilical, and the suits will take care of the rest. The suit also protects the astronauts from depressurization inside the capsule. If the cabin in which the astronauts are housed depressurizes, the SpaceX suits will automatically pressurize, ensuring that oxygen, food and liquid reach and leave the astronaut. The spacesuit comes with touchscreen sensitive gloves for when he or she needs them. This allows the astronauts to operate the controls with ease. The suit makes light use of touchscreen technology, as even the tiniest mistake could be fatal. And they can be worn in one piece, unlike the Aces, which are worn piece by piece. Number three, they are more powerful. Bob Behnken, one of the first astronauts to try out the new SpaceX suits, is quoted as saying, From a training perspective, the revolutionary suits have a high enough fidelity that we can sit in the capsule, put on the suits and go through a situation or scenario where the suits are going to inflate. According to Bob Behnken, such an experience will better prepare astronauts for the rigors of space flight. He maintained that level of fidelity in training, hardware versus PowerPoints and the virtual presentations are extremely important to operate. So that's a big one. The SpaceX team has risen to the occasion and we appreciate the quality assurance measures. SpaceX went to great lengths to ensure that the astronauts' suits were safe. The suits were put through their paces in zero gravity at the Zero Gravity Research Facility. This was accomplished. The next step was to check for depressurization. When a unit, such as a capsule or a spacesuit, loses enough pressure to function properly, it is known as depressurization. This was accomplished by depressurizing the capsule and waiting for the spacesuit to pressurize on its own. The tests were carried out to ensure that the spacesuit pressurizing system was in perfect working order. After passing all the tests, it was time to put it through its paces on a real flight. SpaceX's first step in ensuring their suits were safe for space travel was to test them on a dummy. The dummy was dressed in a stylish suit, suit and sent into space aboard the company's Falcon Heavy rocket. When the Crew Dragon, a reusable spacecraft, completed its first unmanned spaceflight, SpaceX sent another spacesuit wearing dummy, known as Ripley, on board. The next step was to ensure that the crew members were comfortable and safe. During the Demo 2 flight, SpaceX enlisted the help of astronauts Doug Hurley and Bob Behnken to test the sleek spacesuits. The astronauts put on their SpaceX spacesuits to make sure they were comfortable and safe. During the Demo 2 test flight to the International Space Station in May of last year, the test was conducted. Doug Hurley admitted during a press conference from the space station that they have worn and taken off the spacesuits many times and that it is easier to get in and out of them now. It's also worth noting that the SpaceX spacesuits are only intended for use during launch and re-entry and can only be worn inside the capsule. Astronauts must use the extra mobility unit for long walks outside the capsule. What are your thoughts on the new SpaceX spacesuit? Let us know in the comment section down below. That's all for today guys. Thanks for watching the video. If you've enjoyed it, please like, share and subscribe to our channel for more such exciting updates. Until next time.